so I forget how the opening of this game is supposed to be, honestly. Okay. I, I guess we'll just start. So, hello. This is it. Should we be a boy or a girl? Is oh. this our official introduction? Yeah, this is- this, we, we started already. Hello, okay. everyone. Hello! Should we be a boy or a girl? I guess a boy, because I think he looks less lame. Cool. What skin tone? Should, well, I guess we'll just do... I guess just do... What, oh, that's a, that, little... that's a little extreme. Pa paste your dark chocolate. The black one is not even dark chocolate. It's very dark, though. Look at that. Um, I feel like it has a weird undertone, though. You know, I actually... It doesn't look... It's okay. Like, it doesn't... I mean, obviously, it's not, but it does not look natural at all. I'm just gonna go with this one. This seems similar. Um, you know, I'm gonna go with... I wanna go with Red Rise. Alright, so oh, yeah, we have four different this? hairstyles. Huh? Oh, let's um, see. Very Japanese-y, I can actually just tell this right now. Um, I'm going to say... I have this on my main account, so I'll just do this one. Mix up a little bit. Oh, we can choose our shorts. Oh, lord. Yeah, it's a lot of, like, a lot of customization. Yeah, we're good. So, this is Splatoon 2. <coughs> oh my we're god. Very, we're very excited to play this one. Nintendi presents. So, you've never played Splatoon, right, please? Nope, but I'm not gonna lie to you, audience. I have, uh, zero, zero interest. interest in this game. It looks cute. Like, what exactly is it that you do You think don't... it's cute?! Yeah. Oh my god, I think that... No offense to anybody out there, I'm it sure... It doesn't look cute to you? I'm gonna get a lot of hate for this, but um, I think this idea is, like, extremely whack. What do you mean? Like, it kind of, like, I thought they did such a good job, like, aiming for, like, 90s kind of feel, you know? I mean, I guess I can give them like, that, but this just... feels so much like... Remember Nickelodeon with, like, the slime thing and shit? Uh, I actually did not play that game. I was Wait. not invited to that. What, you, you don't remember seeing it on TV at all or anything like that? Oh, I thought you meant like a specific game. I was like, oh, I, I don't remember that. Just game. like how they had like the slime no, thing. I know, how they I had a uh, pick boy. I don't know. There's just nothing about this that draws me in. It, I don't know. I just. Hmm. Something about it is just different to me. I like it. It is different. I will, I'm not saying that it's not. But... I mean, look at this. I can like. The whole idea is like when you're on land, you can only run this fast, but then you can go into this form like you're a little inkling I, guy. Yeah, I, I get And you that. go fast in your ink. You can go up walls. I know the basics, Michael. <coughs> I'm not dumb. As but I just no die. Nothing about this does it for me. I don't it's know. It's just like arms all over again. Arms, like I said, <coughs> I didn't know anything about it, but I feel like arms is only going to be fun for a short time and people are going to get bored of it fast. <coughs> Um, it could be. It's a fat. One thing that I had a little problem with arms, which isn't really the game's fault exactly, is, um, so, have you ever played, say, Tekken? Yeah. Okay, so, like, if you played Street Fighter or Tekken or something like that, or, like, say if you're going to Tekken for the first time, first time playing Tekken, and it has, like, a similar, like, layout of buttons, you know? Like, if you played Street Fighter before and you start playing Tekken, you can kind of, like, draw on your knowledge of, uh, -huh. uh Street Fighter. Whereas ARMS, it's literally like, no, there's no other game out there like that. Which is what I like about it. You know? It differentiates itself just a little bit. Uh, to put it into perspective, I have more interest in ARMS than I have in this game. Okay, wow. Um, well, at least we have our opinions out here. I don't know, it's, it's hip! Just, it looks cute. Like I don't think so at all. Like, you don't think it looks cute? No, I actually feel like this looks really, <laughs> like... Phony and cheap. Not phony, like... I, I just feel like it looks really cheap. Like, I don't know. Like, I'm actually curious, like, what do you mean by cheap? Like, they just kind of rush this game out? Or, like, does it not look polished at all or something? I'm not a big fan of the art. <coughs> I don't really like how the characters look. And... I don't know, like, the town that they live in, mm -hmm. I feel like it's trying really hard to be, like, cool. I'm sorry, but can we just talk about these two? So these are, like, yeah, the announcer see, people. Yeah, this is pretty much what I'm talking about. Okay, I love Marina, though. She looks cute. With the little, like, mixer and shit. Okay, I was just getting plot, because this is the sequel, and one of the original pop stars is missing now, so it's like, oh god, that's where, like, the main campaign starts you. Okay. But you can literally skip all that, and if you want to, just start with the main, um, just go online immediately. Uh, okay, welcome to Inkopolis Square, the new nerve center of Inkling culture. So if you didn't know, this game actually takes place two years after the first game. Okay. Giving all this. Okay, cool. We don't need to know this. This is all, like, good stuff. 
Uh, where were you at just now with your thought? Just like it feels not cheap, but like... I don't know. It's just, it's just the art style doesn't hit you. Nothing's no, really crazy nothing about it. nothing at all draws me into this game. I don't know. Like, I can <clears> give it that it has, like, that 90s feel that you were talking about. <clears> yeah, if that's what they were going for, then they definitely got that. Turn that shit off. But I don't know. There's just nothing about this game that interests me at all. Like, I don't think the game sounds like something <coughs> I'd be interested in to play. Like I said, I don't really care for the art. I just, I don't know. Like, no offense to anybody if you, like, love this game. Oh, this game is, you. like, huge in I Japan. I know it is. I actually have a friend right now who's visiting some family in Japan right now. And he's literally, like, he was, Who? okay. Um, he's, his name's Kenny. Who the fuck is that? He's the one that we're gonna go visit, the one in, like, uh, New Jersey. Mm. Yeah, so, he was there, and he said, like, apparently, like, it was ridiculous, like, how the it. launch was. I mean, this game is huge in Japan, along with, like, Monster Hunter. So, this one is Marie. She is, like, my favorite character of all Splatoon. Mm -hmm. She was originally part, her sister is missing in this game. Okay. So, she's kind of, like, the one that recruits you to be like, hey, help me find her. And it's kind of funny since like two years have passed, she's no longer like the hip pop star anymore. So now she's like saying like, "Oh God, you ever heard of me?" Oh, I see. And then they have corny jokes like that for eel. Okay, that's why I'm. There are some corniness this game. I mean, I can deal with the corny jokes <coughs> in there, but I, I just, <clears throat> I don't know. This game, like, literally, there's nothing. Like nothing. Okay, well, you like, you like more horror games, like. Not horror games, like exclusively, but you like more like adventure games, like say Bloodborne, Skyrim, almost like MMO type games. Yeah, but even then, like mm -hmm. I don't know. It's just this isn't like hitting you in the. This isn't hitting the right buttons for you. Yeah, like just this, right off the bat, it's just like this does nothing for the me. The presentation isn't just like no. catching your eye in the slightest. I, no offense, but I do not think that any of the characters are like cute. So what? Look at her. No. She just looks cute. Oh, even wait, like what the look fuck? at it, you made her spawn away. She looks cute, nah. even though she's wearing a kimono. That's very Japanese. I don't know. Like, I I like it. I mean, this is very. The art style looks fine to me. It's just like, wait, I thought we were underground. Didn't we just go underground? No. We went, okay, whatever. So here's our goal. Right now, what powers the city is called the Great Zapfish. It's been kidnapped and stuff. So what we have to do is uh, save it by just locating it. We're fighting another race called the Octarians. Okay. <laughs> so this is where I'm just gonna give you a little bit of the lure right now. <clears throat> In the first game, you had to collect, the only way you could find out the lore was finding items in the main campaign called the Sunken Scrolls. Okay. And slowly you piece together what's going on, which basically, humanity did exist in this world, but apparently like, the water rose and essentially everyone died. Like, just drowned. Humanity just died and all that was left are uh, these, these people called Inklings, which all that they care about is fashion and battling like type of battling called turf battles which the whole point of turf battles if you don't know is uh, basically it's like the way you play online the whole point of it's not to like get kills or anything it's to um, cover as much land yes that's like the that's the main primary thing you want to do see yeah, i don't know that just i'm like okay what you like the whole killing thing or like do you not like that idea for the multiplayer like i don't know it's, I mean, we already know, like, this just is not all the buttons for you right now. We're just like, we already know why we're doing this. This is like the fresh game out on the street. I love it personally. I like, know you do, but I don't know. If bitches want to play online with me, I'm I've coming. always like, oh, this game looks just so, like, mm. You should have, like, seen us a few weeks ago. I'm just like, hey, Felice, would you like to do Splatoon? And it's like, yeah, mmm. That was basically pretty much it. Ugh. I don't know. Like, <coughs> I, I don't know. It just. It's just not hitting all the right notes. Like, no. Realist, being honest, I'm not. <clears throat> I am not a big fan of the campaign itself because it's basically just to teach you how to play the game and it's just like all this extra shit and finding like the lore of this game. That's all that this campaign is. Really, what most people come to this game for is the online. The online, which the online is fucking fantastic. The online, I can kind of see how that's fun. Just like <clears throat> I don't know. Oh god, you should see. <clears throat> so you know how most consoles have voice chat now? Mm -hmm. With this game, Nintendo, um, they unveiled a new thing called, like, they unveiled their own version of voice chatting. Mm -hmm. And the way how it works is, fuck, that was a long box. 
The way how it works is you have to actually download an app on your phone to use the voice chat with the game. Okay. It's definitely different since it's not like automatically on the system. And I kinda I can kinda understand since the switch is so bloody small. Right. Um <clears throat> I have not connected with it at all yet. I haven't really heard much about it, but it's supposed to be like eventually leading into like a paid service similar to like PlayStation Plus. Huh. Which I'm honestly very happy we just got PlayStation Plus again. Oh, getting all those good deals. Um Hmm. Yeah. I am trying to honestly I what the fuck were we just talking about? I lost it. Oh well. This game and the online play and... I don't know. Yeah, I was thinking about what's the games you like. It's like this isn't gonna be for you. I think... What the fuck just happened to me? Okay. I think a game for you that you're probably gonna like is like, say, Skyrim VR. Well, duh. I remember when we were... I already loved Skyrim, so that's different. I, I just enjoy that we said like, oh, VR looks stupid. We're not gonna touch that. And then Skyrim oh, no. VR. I didn't say that VR looked stupid. I said VR was expensive. I do wanna- I would love to replay, um, like Resident Evil 7. if I had the money, for sure, but that's a lot. Like the little excess amount of income. Oh, I would definitely- Oh, there is something so secret up here. So I'm gonna try to do my best to find the sunken scrolls for all the- Are you fucking kidding me? Okay, let's try it again. Ooh, I'm gonna do sorry. my best to find the sunken scrolls for the people, which... That's not it. I- I feel what these are. I think that's like to upgrade your weapons and stuff like that. They're little broken eels. Um... Shit, where the heck's the sunken scroll then? Wait, I think it's back over here. Is it? Is it? Ah, oh, fuck. I already don't remember. I just played this like two days ago. Oh god. I don't know. Mm. Wait, can I jump down here? Oh, okay. There it is. That's how you find the sunken scroll. Good for you. If you're trying to look for this, this isn't like a tutorial video. This is just whatever this is. Um. I don't know. I still. I we're, we've been put a counter on how many times we said I don't know in this video. But actually, yeah. Just actually, I don't know. It's cool. I, don't know. I keep it's saying like, I don't know because I don't want to like offend piss off people. anybody. Basically. Oh no, you, girl. Because I know that this <clears throat> game has a huge fan base, but I don't know what it is. Girl, There's you're gonna just... piss off Japan, man. They're gonna I'm fucking... sorry, Japan. We're still cool. I hope, but. This game is just not for me. This does not... This game's all doki doki and you're just being angry. This does not do anything for me. This does not call my name. This... it just... This is not, like, speaking to me. No, not okay, in the slightest. Let's just, just, just shoot all these down. Oh, Jesus. <coughs> I don't want to say that it's too, like, little kid of a game. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking, because you don't really like kid-like games, but you like Mario Brothers I sometimes. I was going to say, but it's not even that, because I would play, like, exactly. I'll play Yoshi's World or, like... I still play Pokemon or Well, what if it's because like... you have nostalgia for those, where this one you don't know. have any nostalgia because you've never played it before? Like, you know? when you first showed me this, I was honestly like, oh, this is Nintendo. This looks cool. I mean, the same something right there, Alley. Oh, yeah, so this is one of those little Zapfish thing. We had to collect and build power back to the city. This looks. This doesn't look Nintendo to you? I don't think this is. It's definitely different, Nintendo. From what I was told, this was made by the newer team. I remember team. you told me about it, but I don't know. The I felt new like kids, this Nintendo. was like, oh, okay. This was something. Right. Alright, we'll get... Oh, so I'm thinking in the lore, like, that's Pearl, the chick, well, the little announcer mm -hmm. chicks, which I'm guessing she has something to do with the plot, but everyone kind of not does not like her compared to Marina, because Marina's just fine. Okay. Alright, more on that next time without a gaming. Bye bye now. Dude, you totally don't like this game at all. Oh my god. Wow. Told you, there's nothing about this game that excites me. Nothing even like caught your eye a no, little bit, right? There was the no eyebrow raisings. Like, there's nothing. I don't. Mm -mm. This game does not do it.